Hey everyone, this is Stalini. So I'm going to do a general message for the collective, all star signs. So if you come guided, perhaps this is your message. All right, you'll know if it's your message in the first 50 seconds because if it's not resonating, then it's not resonating. So let's see, a message for the collective, for whoever's watching. So check my community tab because I posted a special and it's only good for today, June 12, 2022. All right, always check my community tab. Follow me on TikTok for daily readings. Hope everyone's staying well. Let's see, what is the message for the collective? If you want a personal, my information is below, as always. Balance. I was going to say, today is all about balance. June 12, 2022. 61222. 222. Two, two, two. Right. So, there is balance as all this year. And this full moon, the strawberry full moon, which I talked about in my last video, is all about pushing that balance, okay? Whether we like it or not. Um, you're going to see stuff and feel things more heightened under this full moon because it's the universe making you change what needs to be changed. Um, there's a 19 here. So some of you are entering relationships and you're leaving toxic relationships and connections behind. You're finding balance in all ways. What else does this collective need to know? Release. Yes. This is the energy right now. The full moon, the super moon energy is already here. Like, you could feel it, okay? Those of you that are intuitive, and I feel like those of you watching are, because I attract the divine, and most of you have your own gifts. Ooh, so many cards. Wow. Blossoming. So you are blossoming into a new chapter in your life. Um, maybe you're focused on your creativity, whatever you put in, you know, intention. Now's the time to put what you want to manifest. And there's a lot of manifestations. There's a lot of marrying numbers, again, with the 33. So, yeah. Self-love, six, balance. All these numbers are about balance. If you ever want to know about a number, like if you want to know about the number 27, then get this Doreen Virtue book, Angel Numbers. Or you can just Google the number. Uh, congratulations, your optimism is attracting wonderful situations and relationships. Stay positive. That This attitude is working in your favor. So, yeah, stay positive, stay elevated, and release what is not working for you. So, you could be seeing the number six. Sometimes you see the six three times, which is not bad. I mean, you might, oh, no, it's the evil number. But that is the universe telling you that there is something off balance or something coming to you that's going to be like not balanced like to be aware of your surroundings to look at your life to reflect to see what is going on in your life that is not really good also to be aware of your surroundings that's the universe warning you of something negative that might be coming forward um to you like if you're out just be aware of your environment right so the masculine, oh my gosh, so this masculine energy definitely has been popping up. I was going to do a twin flame reading, but I was like, I'm just going to leave it open. And you have mirroring energies here because you have the divine feminine, which is the moon. So you literally have the emperor 
and the empress you have 42 16 more balanced numbers so full moon we are in the full moon energy so it's funny that this is on the bottom of the deck we have miss beautiful goddess of the moon in her full glory use this full moon super moon energy for your benefit use it harness it okay and you have the emperor and the empress divine mass and divine feminine energies here so you know this super moon could be pushing some of you guys into union all right some of you i wouldn't be surprised if you hear from an emperor um divine femme you are in your divine femme empress energy and this is pulling the divine masculine energy to you so let us get more into this Tell me more about this masculine energy coming towards the collective. Now, some of you are dealing with soulmates. Some of you, your throat chakra has been acting up, and it is not the big C word that I'm not going to say. Um, it's your throat chakra clearing, because I know my throat chakra has been like acting up. There's this communication that needs to be said. So, by the way, Divine Masculine is never going to be prosperous without their Empress. The universe will not reward them until they're with their Empress. Ooh, so this person is very focused on you. The Devil card. The Three of Cups. Perhaps this situation ended because of a third party situation they want union they're very focused on this union on this reconciliation with you tell me more oh yes the queen of pentacles they are looking at you as the beautiful queen that doesn't need anyone that is bountiful that is nurturing that is beautiful okay they're looking at you like i want my queen back so what is this masculine plotting? They're manifesting. You're manifesting. This divine masculine definitely has gifts. They're up to something. Look at that. Look at that. They are like definitely up to something. They could be doing some type of magic work on you, divine from King of Swords. Ooh. So this divine masculine could have separated recently or in the past from a situation divorced um this emperor wants to have a serious conversation they were not budging okay but they're looking at you like okay my empress is not chasing me well empresses don't chase they want this ten of pentacles with you they want this marriage with you they're going to make a decision with the two of wands they feel like they're gonna have to fight off another masculine look at that king of wands so this has been coming out a lot in the collective like i said some of you are dealing with soulmates or they think you're dealing with soulmates you're attracting of a lot of attention i mean they're looking at you in your queen of pentacles energy it could be earth sign it could be dealing with the air sign it could be dealing with fire sign it doesn't have to be but they're looking at you like Everybody wants you. Everybody's after you. Everybody, you know, someone could be having your eye. Um, with this magician card, they could have, like, went to talk, you know, to a psychic and doing rituals. Like, the psychic could have told them something that they didn't like. And, yeah, and they feel like they have to fight. Like, they feel like they won, but then now they feel like, you know, they won the war, but then they lost the battle. This emperor was in their head, and now they're in their head that, you know, you're with someone else. Maybe they don't feel your energy anymore. And that's what has to happen, actually. It's, I hate how that is, though. You know, many times, 
this uh, twin flame situation, I feel like this is definitely about a twin flame situation, which I did. It wasn't purposely focused on twin flame reading, but oh, spirits wanted to do what they wanted to do. And this um, emperor definitely feels that you are entertaining others, okay? Um, they're having all kinds of thoughts in their head that you're like having sex with someone else that, you know, wait, you know, they're so bothered. So they want justice in this situation. Ooh, eight of cups. They feel like you're walking away and now they have to come back with this major offer. Um, yeah, a home commitment <laughs> baby they want to get out of this nine of swords energy so they know that the only way is if they walk away from their ego walk away from their old life before they lose you before you completely walk away i mean some of you could have like completely walked away from this situation um but they want to make right their wrongs they're going to come out of hiding with the hermit in reverse. Oh, wow. Yep. They're going to make a divine decision. The divine could be bothering them, sending them all kinds of reminders and messages. And then they're thinking like, oh, what do I do? What do I do with my empress? Okay. And they want to come back around with the world in reverse. Apology. So expect some type of message from them they've thought about this and thought about this and they're exhausting themselves not coming forward with the four of swords they're like oh my gosh <sighs> so it's shaking so if you want to help my channel out you could donate to my cash app or paypal let us see also youtube made a new feature the thank you feature so if you want to donate to this channel and you like my videos and you want to like say thank you then you can send donation just by clicking on that thank you button is definitely going to send some type of message to you once they think about what to do um yeah once they get out of their heads which they are going to though this full moon is going to push this divine masculine for this this divine masculine mm. So they think that you are um, being sneaky. Like the tables have turned. They feel like you are with someone else, Divine Femme. What is going on with you, Divine Femme? Well, you're focused on the Ace of Pentacles. You're like, I'm going to have my happy home with or without i'm focused on my abundance some of you you know you're like i'm gonna have my babies i'm gonna have my marriage there's some type of commitment coming to you divine from oh, moon energy lots is gonna happen under the moon what is this ace of pentacles about <laughs> page of cups so this ace of pentacles literally could be the divine masculine sending you a message you're gonna get a message you have mirroring energies and then yeah they have the ace of pentacles as well so tell me more about the divine from this okay nine of wands you're kind of on the defensive sides you are protecting your heart at this point you're not dealing with any more bs what else divine from what's going on with you 
yeah, you're putting a block up, like you're not dealing with it. You're, and the divine masculine could sense that, you know, you're blocking out anything that is not serving you. Um, some of you could have blocked them. <laughs> You're focused on your healing and you're focused on balance, Divine Femme. You know, that's what you're focused on. So, yeah. What else for my Divine Femme? Someone's rushing in with the Knight of Wands. Is it Divine Masculine? Is it a soulmate? Someone's rushing in for you. This happiness, this wish fulfillment. Someone is about to crown you, Divine Femme, with the Six of Wands. They want a victory. They want to conquer you. Oh, my God, chills. Divine Femme, I said some of you are dealing with someone else, and the Divine Masculine pick up on this. The Lover's card. Divine Femme, many of you are going to have to choose between the Divine Masculine and someone else. Who is it going to be? the lovers oh yes and this is twin flame energy so time for union for this collective wow so let's see what does this divine masculine want to tell you right now what does this divine masculine want to tell you Sometimes I cry over you. Yeah, this divine asset knows what they did. And they were, with the justice card in their energy, I feel like they got served. Like, they got punished by the universe. They want to give you breakfast in bed within a week. Wow. So some of you are definitely going to get communication under this super full moon under this strawberry moon you're gonna get communication and i would love to know who some of you are getting that communication within a week from watching this video even if you watch this video after the full moon energy which lasts like two weeks you know this is still your message even if you come to it three months from now whenever the divine timing has pushed you to watch this video some of you are getting this within a week under a full moon this communication you are my temptation so this divine masculine sees you as someone they can't resist i want to date you they want to take you out they want to romance you spying on you mm -hmm. and this is why they're in their heads but hello divine masculine if you're watching you're not going to know what this divine femme is doing unless you speak up i regret it all yep they regret it all one more i got played and i'm embarrassed over it this divine masculine is embarrassed that's why for a lot of them that's why they did not come forward but now they're like okay it's do or die if i don't come forward that's it she's gonna end up marrying someone else to the pentacles yep they definitely think that you're juggling others and then the tower in reverse you're not gonna see this coming they want to rebuild the, the moon card oh my gosh i could go all day <sighs> you're not dealing with those burdens anymore um yeah so i hope you enjoyed this reading and like this video for me talk to you soon bye